Thank God I've been doing public speaking for the last two years. <laughs> Hi everyone, so for those who don't know me, although I'm pretty sure everyone here does, uh, my name is Luke. I've been a student from doing Carly Salat and Carly Sikaran for the last seven years. Um, it all started back in 2015. I was at a leadership camp sponsored by Rotary. Um, and whilst there, I ran into a chance encounter with someone who would later become a very good friend to me who was wearing a shirt that had Carly Sikaran on it and the big pyramid with all these different insignia on it. I thought, okay, this is really cool. Um, so I was curious about it and contacted them and they got me in touch with Advanced Martial Arts and Fitness and I walked in completely insecure, nervous, but curious all the same into this glorious dojo and was just blown away by the fact that I could actually get to hit people with weapons. I thought, this is the coolest shit I've ever seen. So when, when I, within three days, um, I immediately was given my, my gear, my dagger, sticks, all that, not realizing I'd just been conscripted to join the club. Not that it mattered anyway, because the rest was history after that. So when I first joined, it was very uncomfortable for me, especially doing things like dagger, where I didn't have the control. So understanding that and learning how to control my energy was one of the hardest things I had to learn. But over time, I started to see the change. I was able to relax more and enjoy it even more. What kept me going for the first few years was definitely watching the people who wore our red shirts and our black shirts as well, getting inspired by seeing them doing everything, seeing all that magic that they were doing and me wanting to be there at some point. So. During that time, I was also a, an athlete, um, but I was more or less on my way out. I wasn't happy with the life I was doing. I was uh, coming from a lifestyle of competitive where I felt like I had to prove myself all the time. So coming from that to here was also part of what made it so uncomfortable, feeling like I can just be who I am. And just like Guru Mike, I'm introverted as hell, which you probably don't realize. So through Carly and Martial Arts Now, I've learned so much more about myself and who I am as a whole. The skills you learn here can apply to so many aspects of your life. For me, it gave me more goals, which meant uh, better focus, discipline, the joy of sharing this art with someone else, building others up to be better than what they thought they were and making you better as a result. It also gave me much more satisfaction on a personal level. Instead of being insecure, I'm now the guy who will jump on the mat and work with anyone. I also learned to be a better communicator through Carly and the ITP program. Carly came to me when I needed it the most, but I didn't truly really realize it at the time. So here we are, seven years later, and going towards my black belt, a rank I originally had no aspiration of achieving. So what does it mean to be a black belt? For me, it is a master of the basics first and foremost. This is the person who has done them to where they not only can do it consistently, but demonstrate that to everyone and then more. They are the artist who is now ready to paint their artwork on a canvas. They are also the commander, as Guru Mike says, the one that's leading the troops from the front, the whites, the yellows and the reds, inspiring them and pushing them past their limits. A true black belt cannot lead their team unless they do so by example. They're not only just a leader, but a teammate to everyone. The person who everyone wants to learn from and train with. If I cannot be a good teammate, then I have failed not only you, but also myself. The black belt is a visionary. They see the potential in every student. Anyone can do it, but to truly be one, the black belt must show commitment, discipline, and attitude. Finally, the black belt is humble. It is not about power or status. All of us became black belts because we believe in service above self. We love what we do, and we want to give it back to all of you. That is what I want to do for all of you. Being a black belt does not mean you stop learning either. You're just on the tip of the iceberg. So Kali as a whole, and the team, all of you, that is everyone here that I train with every time. It made me better, stronger, and happier than I ever could have been without it. I'm far more confident in myself, and I can't wait to see where my path takes me going forward. Thank you, everyone. And for the dragon, blue for the Muay Thai, yellow for the Karate, and red for the Kali. Thank you. Thank you.